Okay, is there a Batman symbol in there anywhere? No. Okay. Just pull up. Okay. Ready. Are you going? Okay, good. At Maker Faire here in the Bay Area, if you don't stop by the PrinterBot booth, you don't get a chance to meet Brooke. Hi, Brooke. Hey, what's up, man? How are you doing? Good. It's a little crazy. I'm already starting to feel my voice go, but I'm doing good, man. Meeting these folks is awesome. Everyone's very passionate about 3D printing, and just from standing here in your booth, it seems like people are very, very passionate about their printer bots. Why is that? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, seriously, it's like, you love this? How This is awesome. I love this. So it is kind of like, you, you talk to these people on email, and you see them in Twitter, like your icon or whatever. It is so much better meeting them in person, being in the same room. I mean, this family right here just told me that they started a cake topper business. He quit his day job. He's got 15 printer bots. He, it's so cool. Like, That's wonderful. I know. And his kids are like growing up in the houses with 15 printers. I'm like, this is so cool. Another guy from Costa Rica, he distributes. But he was telling me, oh, yeah, he, uh, this guy, he lived in a tin house. It's like four by four feet. I mean, like he barely has room for a bed. It's a bed and a chair and his computer. And he bought a printer bot, and he earned money from printing things to buy a motorcycle because he never had a vehicle. And then he started working for me, and now he's fixing printers. He has a job. He's going to university. And I'm, he said, all because of a 3D printer. I'm like, this is blowing my mind. This is awesome. That's, those are incredible stories. Yeah, and it's I just, just heard them like 10 minutes ago. And it's not even, let's see, know, it's 1230. It started, I know. Oh, man. Well, okay. I did hear you have a new printer coming out. Can you tell me about it? Yeah. So it's the Simple V2. And the big deal is we're really trying to make it easier to use. So we've got an LCD touchscreen. It has Wi-Fi. You don't even need the USB cable. You can use it if you want to. Um, but all of our round bars are, are replaced with linear rails and carriages. So all around. So it's actually Simple-er than the, the, the other one because it's less parts, right? So it's bigger, it's eight inches by six inches by eight inches versus six by six by six. And so there's just a lot of stuff like crazy new tech we discovered this year. We put an on switch, an on off switch is now included in the printer. So I mean, and it's got feet, like little rubber feet. Like it's the details. <laughs> but anyway, we just went through like everything that I should have done a long time ago is in this thing. But it's been a long haul because it's all new electronics. Optionally, you can tie it to the cloud with a new service that we're doing. Um, so there's a lot of moving parts. It used to be I could just go into the workshop and like build something, like a crappy version of it, and hand it to my uh, you know, engineers and say, let's make this beautiful. But now it's like software, hardware, we got to do cloud software, new electronics, we got to make electronics. So anyway, lots of goodies in this one. It is more expensive. It's $849 right now, $899 later. But it is totally worth it because it's going to be a great, great machine to use. Well, you've, you're still below that $1,000 price point, and I think that's, that's the price point that people really start to think about owning a printer at home. And so with all of those features, that could be what starts driving massive adoption. That's kind of exciting. Yeah, I think the, the thing that will differ, differentiate PrinterBot from others is going to be ease of use. It's always been about value, but the software is just too clunky. It's too many settings. There's too many sliders. So just to, in the cloud, you don't even have to know about slicing. All you got to know is what printer you have and what plastic you want to use and if it's high, low, or medium resolution. So we're trying to take some of the geekiness out of it and just make it easy to use. On the screen, you literally swipe like you would on your phone and you can see a little picture of what it is you're going to print and there's a print button. You said print and it goes. That's fantastic. Okay, I know you're busy, so one last question. What is the favorite thing you've printed on a printer bot? You know, I get that all the time, and it's, it actually is hard for me to, to say. But I will, I, the thing I'm most excited about right now is I like challenges. And so there's this, there's this guy, this sweet guy in ca uh, Canada, that's de designing a 3D printed um, Hughes H1 airplane. If you've seen the old uh, uh, Hughes movie, it's this plane that he only flew. There was only a couple of them. It's this beautiful, old-looking, sleek plane. So I, I made this Big E printer, is what we call it, Big E, Big E, and uh, it's like eight foot long, four foot tall, four foot wide. So it's huge. That's massive. Yeah, yeah. So this RC plane is going to be an eight foot, over eight foot wingspan. <laughs> there is a lot of challenges in printing something that big and to actually see it fly. So 
We're just getting started, but it's now the, the model, the out, outside of the model is done, and now we get to start testing different ways to print it. It's gonna be super hard, but I have a small model of it that's like three foot by four foot, and I have printed one that big. So it's just so fun to do something that I've never done, and that I don't even know if it's possible, um, but it's a great challenge. So that's the stuff that I dig my teeth into, something that nobody else can do or has done. We're gonna do it. There you go. Okay, I like that. Your your favorite isn't necessarily a model, but your favorite is the challenge that it brings. So that's wonderful. You know, Brooke, it's been amazing meeting you. Thank you so much. And let's end it properly with a high five. Yeah.